Hello there everyone, and welcome to Let's Unbox Fire Emblem Warriors Special Edition. This is Fire Emblem Warriors for the new Nintendo 3DS and Nintendo Switch, which just barely came out, and this is the Special Edition, so let's go ahead and unbox it. Joining me, I have a very special guest, my nephew Jacob. He, you can hear him making noises in the background. Say hello to the people, Jacob. He's two, so he doesn't talk much. He just kind of looked at me when I said his name. He does make noises, though, and he does have somewhat coherent words. So you might hear him, like, make noises every now and then. He's messing around with some toys right now. Anyways, I have him in this unboxing video because he really wanted to play with this box. And I thought, you know, why not have him make it stand out? And I also have him here to distract you from the fact that this is already opened. Yeah, I already tried to make an unboxing video earlier. But I accidentally recorded it in portrait, not landscape. And I didn't even realize that. And I feel really dumb. So this is already open and I know what's inside. But I'm making an unboxing video anyways because I know what's in it, but you don't. Well, you probably do because you can find the information online. But let's go ahead and unbox it. So... Jacob, if you will assist me here, go ahead and go ahead and open this. Open. No, don't give me the remote. Open the box. You wanted to play with it earlier. Here, I'll help you. Oh no, he's walking away. He doesn't want to be a part of this. Okay, I'll just. So, let's see what we pull out of here first. First, we have the poster. Okay, JJ, open the poster. I shouldn't trust a baby with a poster, but let's see how this works. Oh, he's going. He's going. Okay, there you go. <laughs> oh no, he he ignored the poster. Okay. No, no, don't move on to the... Okay, he's moving on to the music. We'll look at the poster in a moment. He wants to play with the music. Okay, so if you... open, Okay, so... Have it? No, buddy, I gotta zoom in on it. Okay, he just wants to open it up right away. So there you go. Three CDs. Disc 3 has Lin. Disc 2 has Corrin. And he really wants to take out that Mark CD. I bet he really likes the music on this one. He's like, oh, yeah. Those are some, uh, some good tunes. So there you go. There's that. Uh, if we close it up, there it has, like, little sprites and stuff for the characters. So as a character sprite, that's cool. And then, oh, he's playing with the Lin one now, okay. And then back here, oh, wrong way to close it. And then back here, more characters and, like, music track and stuff. So that's that. So I didn't put the music away. Let's go back to the poster now. Take out the poster, okay? So let's see if he can open it. I might assist him, but we'll, let's see what he can do first. He's going, he's going. Okay, here. I'll help you out, because I don't want you to rip it, buddy. No, no, he's got it, he's got it. Okay, now I fold this way. He's getting mad because I'm not letting him do it. Okay, okay, just... No, not the music, silly, the poster. He really likes that sound selection. Okay, I'll look at the poster myself because he likes the music. So in here, the poster we have... Here it is in Japanese, which is the... It's the characters, the game they're from, and the Japanese artwork. And then the reverse of it is in English. So, there's the characters in the game, the game that they're from, and all of that information. I never understood double-sided posters because if you think about it... Posters are either hung up or framed, so you can't really see the other side. And if you have it in a frame, sure, you can flip it around and take it out of the frame, flip it around, put it back in. But that just seems like so much work. Okay, has he moved on? He's moved on from the CD. He's playing with the poster now. That's not how you play with posters, buddy. You're going to rip it like that. Let me take that away from him before he damages it. Okay, cutie, we're moving on. Next one. Next. Got it? Here, what's this? Show us what that is. Show the camera what that is. He's trying to open it, but it's still in plastic. This is the actual game, so... Okay, Alto, we'll take the game from you. He's so violent, he wants to unbox everything himself. Oh! Told you he talked. Okay, can I, can I see the game to show the people? Can the people see the game? There's the game upside down, because Jacob is being very territorial with the game. He's determined to open it. Here, let me assist you with that. Just, just slightly. There you go. You know, it's funny, that tear right there that I pulled on, it was already like that. When I received the package brand new, it, the plastic was already, like, messed up. But I'm not going to complain because it's a minor thing. No, you can't put plastic back. That's not how that works. Isn't he the most adorable person ever? This is the cutest unboxing ever. It might not be professional, but it's adorable. So there you go, there's that. Hello. Yeah, now go ahead and open it. Open it, come on, like this. You know how to open. Oh, he's looking at the characters. Who are you looking at? Oh, you're looking at Marth, okay. Is that Marth? I can't tell upside down. Okay, got it? Here, let me flip it around for the... Okay, fine, you can play with the game. The people don't get to see anything. Here, just, just let me sh zoom in like this. This is really hard to cooperate with a two-year-old. Yes, Marth, you're pointing at Marth, I see that. That's, uh, Liana. Yes, now you're pointing at Liana. Okay. Can, can we see the inside? Why don't you... Okay. I'm just gonna let him play with that. He's getting very territorial. Yeah, now I want to get on his bad side. And then the last thing we have in here are the uh, Fire Emblem Warriors character cards. I didn't actually know what this was until I opened it up, but there you go. So the back has more character sprites, and then in the middle right here, you have... Oh, well, it's not there because 
it's showing the cards. But normally, if you don't have the cards here, in the middle right here shows, um, it shows, uh, Leo. Because it has, like, a little, um, case carrying thing right here. Look, I'll show you right now. Like, oh, he's playing the game back. See? He knows how to clean up after a proper unboxing. Good boy. Right here. If you have it in, like, this, you have Leo right there. So that's how it's supposed to go, but I put it in, like, this backwards. So here are the character cards, which I have already taken the liberty of putting in order from best character to worst, with a couple of um, exceptions. Like, for example, right here you'll see uh, Liana's the first one. Not because she's the best character, but because this is her and Rowan's game. So I, they're at the bottom when you get this, and I don't know why. Because it's their game, so they should be at the top. Don't, don't shake it, buddy. That's how you damage things. Oh, he took. He, he's not playing with it anymore. I can finally show this to you. Okay, so this is the game case, the back of it. That's the front of it, and when you open it up, here's what the game looks like. It's just like a, it's like a, it'll, a map, basically, and then there's the game. So there's that. He's playing with the box set now, but not, it can't do anything. So anyways, you can't open that. It's already open. So, alright, so there I have Leo at the top, because he's my favorite Fire Emblem character. So there's that. Then I have Sakura, because I really like her. I have Marth. I haven't played his game, but I want to, and I can already tell I like his character. So, there's that. He's talking into the thing. That's cute. So I have Ryoma here. Because, like, he's one of my favorite characters. Don't throw my stuff. Man, this was a terrible idea. Why do I think I could trust a two-year-old to unbox? Now, uh, Kata here. Again, haven't played the game, but I like her character. Oh, you want to play with Kata? Okay, I'm just going to let him play with Kata there. These things are sturdy, so I can, I can trust him to play with it. I have Lucina there. And then, okay, you want Xander now. That's fine. I have Celica here. There's Anna. No, don't take all of them. I have to go through them. Luckily, I managed to get them... Corrin's supposed to be at the bottom. What are you doing so far up? No. So there's uh, female Robin there. Then Krom, Frederick, male Robin, Takumi, Lin, Tiki. This is out of order. This is in the order from favorite to least favorite. Because there's no way, there's no way that um, the Takumi would be so far down. Or Lin. That doesn't make sense. Elise. Cordelia, yeah, she should be a little bit higher up. Not too high, but a bit more. Hinoka, the female Corrin. Okay, yeah. Th these three are in order right here. Female Corrin, I really don't... Like, I just like Corrin in general. But female, slightly better than male. And then Camilla's there. Oh, he wants me to carry him now. Okay. Okay, I'm carrying him. So, there is my messy unboxing with assistance from a two-year-old. So, I'm going to do one last thing before I, uh, before I finish up here. So, um, give me a moment. I'm going to let him pick out one character card. And that's going to be his favorite character. Okay, I'm back, and I have organized all of the characters in no particular order. They're all right there, so now I'm going to go ahead and give him freedom. Go ahead, grab whichever one you want. He's going for the bottom, he's going for the bottom. Okay, Frederick. He chose Frederick. Oh, no, 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 he moved on, he moved on. Talk to me. Is that your final pick? He's going, hey, Frederick, he chose Frederick. Okay, so there's Frederick. Now let me pick those up and move on to the next row. Okay, there's the next row there. You have uh, Camilla. Next row there, you have Camilla, Corin, Elise, Lynn, and Lucina. So go ahead and pick one. Pick one, Jacob. Any one you want. Go ahead. Pick. I don't think he wants to play anymore. Yeah, he's tired of this game. He's like, I don't care about your tactical RPGs, Uncle. Can I watch Mickey Mouse? So he chose Frederick and then game over. But there you go. This has been the most random unboxing because I don't think I've ever seen an unboxing video that unboxing video that has a two-year-old in it but uh, I hope you enjoyed it was kind of cute I guess say bye to the people JJ I'll treat that as a goodbye